Investors won't be able to buy XRP after this happens. Bex's Pay, a RippleNet user, has announced another partnership through which Ripple's money transfer services will be available to more than 54 million users from Latin America. Welcome to the Rich Club channel. If you like this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel. Do you think the analysts are right about XRP? Write the answers in the comments. Giving away 500 XRP at the end of the week. One random subscriber will receive XRP coins. Take a look at the instructions in the comments section. All you need to do is write the word XRP. Watch the video to the end to like and subscribe. Bex's Pay will now be responsible for transactions made through NUPay, New Bank's online payment system for e-commerce. This means that Bex's Pay will act as a payment intermediary for 54 million New Bank customers. The hashtag RippleBexesPay user signs a partnership agreement under which they will make intermediary payments for 54 new bank customers, which will lead to an increase in the number of people accessing international products and services and further democratization of cross-border transactions. Brazilian company Bexes Banco, which processes cross-border payments in electronic commerce for millions of customers, joined RippleNet in 2017 to connect with participating banks in North America, Europe, and Asia. In May, Nubank, Brazil's largest digital bank, announced that it had added the ability for customers to buy and sell Bitcoin, BTC, and Ethers ETH, on its platform with the intention of adding more cryptocurrencies in the near future. Earlier in May, Lithuanian online money transfer provider Finci announced its partnership with Ripple for cross-border payments with RippleNet on-demand liquidity. ODL uses XRP to provide cross-border payments at a fraction of the cost and reportedly at a faster rate than traditional payment systems. According to the XRP Skin service, the decentralized blockchain XRP ledger has reached a historic milestone by successfully closing the 72 millionth registry. A few hours ago, XRP Ledger successfully closed the 72 millionth registry. Many thanks to everyone who supports and manages the network. XRP Ledger, or XRPL, is a decentralized, open-source, uncontrolled blockchain to which anyone can contribute, develop, and make transactions. XRPL uses a consensus algorithm in which designated servers, called validators, come to an agreement on the order and results of XRP transactions every 3 to 5 seconds. To prevent malicious manipulation of a distributed database, its integrity is controlled by validator nodes that are trusted by the majority of network participants, and each of which stores its own copy of the registry, independent of other nodes. Any changes that may affect transaction processing or consensus must be approved by at least 80% of the network participants. Each user has his own UNL unique node list, which he trusts, including validators and the circle of persons, economic agents, and currencies within which he wants to operate. Validators monitor each other by constantly comparing their registry versions until a qualified majority is reached. Consensus is the final phase of each transaction. Transactions that are consistent with the qualified majority of validator nodes are considered confirmed. This is a commit of both the specific transaction and the latest version of the registry, LCL. Currently, there are more than 150 validators in the registry, which are managed by universities, exchanges, enterprises, and individuals, including Ripple. Of these, 35 are in the list of unique nodes. Ripple launches six of these nodes. A former employee of the Ripple Developer Division, Matt Hamilton, formerly Director of Developer Relations at RippleX, explained why XRP has been consistently in the top 10 cryptocurrencies by market capitalization for several years. His comment came in response to a tweet by the media manager of NFT social maker Victor Duran, who expressed his bewilderment that XRP has remained in the top for so many years, although it does not have DX, NFT and smart contracts, and in addition, there is now a lawsuit against the SEC. Without DEX? The XRP registry was the very first DEX. This is the first blockchain that allowed tokenization of assets. He has an NFT, and the community is currently voting to activate NFT support. Most of the functions of smart contracts are built in, but hooks are also being developed.
Despite leaving the company, Hamilton remains an active participant in the XRP community and one of its authoritative members. He repeatedly spoke online in defense of XRPL from various attacks and also covered many important points in his work. XRP is the first cryptocurrency made not on Bitcoin code. Recently, we have already seen many ups and downs, including those coins that rose above XRP in the rating. There is no need to go far, the story of Terra, Luna, it's not finished yet, and Solana has stopped for the seventh time this year. Therefore, the answer is simple XRP Ledger works and performs its stated functions. This is a serious claim that the coin will successfully survive the crisis times. Industry experts have predicted many times that most coins will eventually disappear. Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse, in one of his last interviews at the World Economic Forum in Davos, also stated that many cryptocurrencies will not survive. XRP among other leading altcoins is consolidating on the chart. Bitcoin fell below the $30,000 price level, which weakened the altcoin price movement. Over the past 24 hours, XRP has not changed in price. Over the past 24 hours, altcoin has gained only 2. 4%. On the chart, the coin showed a bearish price movement since the coin could disrupt consolidation. Currently, the coin has found support at $0.34. The last time the coin touched the price level was in February 2021. If the coin drops lower, it may touch the support level of $0.28. The capitalization of the global cryptocurrency market today amounted to 1. $28 trillion with an increase of 0.7%. Positive changes over the past 24 hours. If the bulls continue to try to overcome the resistance level of $0.43, then the coin is moving towards another drop. For the bulls to return, XRP must overcome the aforementioned price resistance and trade around $0.43. The trading volume of XRP has fallen sharply, as can be seen on the one-day chart. The volume band was red, which indicated a bearish significance in the market. Buying power was trying to rise on the chart. After the coin was oversold, it recovered slightly, as can be seen from the relative strength index. At the time of writing, the RSI was above the oversold zone, despite the same strong selling pressure in the market. The XRP price struggled to overcome the 20 SMA line. At the time of printing, the coin was still below 20 SMA, which means that the bears were driving the price momentum in the market. If there is a demand for the coin, the coin may rise above the 20 SMA line, which may push XRP to a price of about $0. 40. The current price of XRP for today you can see yourself on the screens, and the trading volume for 24 hours is 12944360065 US dollars. We are updating our XRP price in US dollars in real time. XRP has dropped 4.8% in the last 24 hours. Do you think XRP will be able to win the court and restore its former price? Write the answers in the comments. That's it for today. Thank you for watching this video to the end. If you liked it, then don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel.